Bitcoin price prediction July 2020. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'll be talking about whether Bitcoin bull trend has started. Bitcoin is up over 200% since April and it has had a huge move up in the past day. I was talking about potential thousand candle coming above 10.5k. We have had a almost $1,500 candle and it's broken huge resistance, potentially weekly trend and it is looking good. So I'll be talking about bitcoin i'll also be talking about altcoin so most of you guys follow me for my altcoin calls and uh, hopefully you guys have made money it's been amazing trading cardano Chainlink, tezos v chain those coins have gone 100 200 300 percent and some of the small caps as well if you watch these videos they were amazing videos so i recommend you go watch them and make sure you smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button for more updates i also post charts as well uh, daily or every other day to keep you guys up to date so in this video guys i'll talk a bit about what the altcoin market cycle is i'll talk about how bitcoin affects everything whether you trade altcoin small or small cap coins this year i'll share with you exactly how i've traded bitcoin and other altcoins cardano ada it's a really important video so it's a five ten minute video i highly recommend you watch the full video and guys uh, what i do want to talk about is uh, i'll also share with you some levels that i'm looking to buy bitcoin and where i think bitcoin is going to go next at the end of the video so uh, let's get into talking about the whole market so the way i see the crypto market works is bitcoin pumps first the large cap altcoins pumps then small cap altcoin pumps and then we have the big bitcoin breakout which ruined altcoins this was posted about a week or so ago and if you check the youtube as well this is not after the fact i posted on youtube as well and this is exactly what's happened uh, we can see the ADA. ADA has been a huge trade and I was still in 25% which I got stopped out when it got below it. That was the level I was looking out for. Uh, that's why I talk about taking profit. Most people you know can take and make money themselves, buy coins that they like. They don't really know when to take profit. So um, one of the things I was talking about lately was a potential Bitcoin breakout. When Bitcoin breaks out other coins don't do very well. So I posted this like I said a couple of, a week or so ago. So luckily uh, we've taken some profits especially on most of the ADA coins and when Ethereum broke out I didn't get the best Bitcoin trade I'll share with you exactly how I've traded Bitcoin as well but Ethereum is one that I posted a live signal when I was buying uh, Ethereum there's a forex trade as well which gold and silver has probably made me more money than Bitcoin this week so uh, that's how I see the altcoin market now let's get talking about Bitcoin so Bitcoin was in the sideways range and believe it or not so I long Bitcoin at 4,000 you can go watch the videos I shared it live in the group if you want to take your trading to the next level there's a special offer in the yearly sign up now before that runs out or the prices go up but I was long Bitcoin here and I was bearish here, I'm not going to lie. I took a short here and I was looking for a breakdown. It didn't break down. I took half off here and I got stopped out in the second half of my position above 9.6k. Um, the way I traded, I got in Ethereum in a great position. Ethereum broke out beforehand. Ethereum has been an amazing. I showed you exactly where I bought Ethereum. That was an amazing trade. I will be making a video on Ethereum and De DeFi or decentralized uh, finance soon. So uh, stay tuned for that. So Bitcoin the way i traded uh, bitcoin was guys when bitcoin broke out uh, my plan was above 10 and a half k i was gonna buy because after uh, when uh, when something huge 10 and a half thousand we've not gotten above it you know since um since almost you have to go back in f last year even to see when we were above it so that that would have been a new highs this year which is a very key level and i said uh, in my previous videos if we get back above it we can have that huge you know five thousand sorry not five thousand a thousand dollar f u green candle or down candle uh, and i just bought it with stop and i see what happened and that's exactly what happened i talk about it yesterday uh, when i was looking to buy a uh, bitcoin and luckily it worked out so i was talking about buying bitcoin about 10k uh, bitcoin i talked about potential 1k move up or down and um, i had a stop below it and it had a move up uh, i took half off and i was waiting for the next trade so i was going on to the five minute when when i missed so i missed the four hour trade so i really recommend you guys have a strategy whether you use mine or you create one or your own for 
less than 30 bucks 40 bucks you can check out my strategy it's really important to have a strategy otherwise guys you're gambling with your money and you don't get make money so uh, whether you use mine or yours have a strategy my strategy was to buy this for our pullback unfortunately we did not get that for our pullback and sometimes the market works like that when you don't get the pullback you just have to move on I didn't chase it I uh, when something when it breaks that resistance that's when I didn't start forming I waited for breakouts and you can see there's loads of alerts on here so this is how I trade so I brought I brought the five minute pullback so let me share with you that chart as well when I posted that um, so you can see yesterday last night I was waiting for Bitcoin on the five minute chart to break out with a chart and I said I was going to buy a move some other people were buying as well which is great to see which is a bright above the 11k that was yesterday that was the day before and 11k broke out it had another huge move up you take half off and then you let it run so this is exactly how I've been trading Bitcoin. Hopefully uh, you guys have traded this as well. We get these opportunities where we get huge moves up and this potential uh, uh, to be making money. And even before that, uh, I shared this with you guys on uh, on YouTube as well the zones that I like to buy so these are the stuff that I share you know where to buy where to sell when to trade altcoins you have to you know really need to lose take profit in a uh, chain link uh, where to take profit this red zone was the level we were looking if it closed below it we were gonna close our trades so what now that's how I've been trading that's great Rocco and I've showed you exactly how I've traded as well not just after the fact exactly where I was buying and selling now what am I looking at so I've got my alert set here 11k was the my first target so 11k hit so once 11k hit hey, I've taken most of it off um, and I'm still in half um, uh, from this trade I got stopped out on this one on the stop below but I'm still the bix when it broke I bought some uh, my stop is below 10k I want to see what Bitcoin does at 10 and a half K on the four hour pullback so this is the level I was looking for if it pulls back to this four hour zone and bounces from it great I'll keep holding and I'll look to buy if it gets above 11k 11k is huge resistance we've just had a thousand K candle I want to see what happens sometimes we don't get pullbacks and I made that mistake 4k I bought but I didn't buy um, here I didn't buy this breakout I had bought some at 5 and 4k for long term holding but I didn't buy this breakout because I didn't think it was going to break out what happened it carried on on a huge move up up to the 14k's uh, when it broke out so sometimes you don't get pullback same with the silver trade silver trade has been another amazing trade so i talk about bitcoin and forex it's important to combine all the markets when you're trading not just one market so so I'm already in Bitcoin like I talked about share with you the levels that I bought and I'm waiting for a break above this of my alert set I'll let the group know I'll let you guys on YouTube you can't make another video um, I'll do I'll try and do a live stream so uh, uh, soon for YouTube I'll try and do one free live stream a month I'll try and do one soon but check out the group if you want more but three to four live stream and access to that course and updates so I'm looking for a break above now if Bitcoin can't hold uh, on the four hour bounce I'll look to sell wait for a consolidation and break out sometimes if I don't don't get this pullback and it does this I will look to buy on go on to the five minute time frame look for my strategy there's a strategy video on my YouTube channel as well for free you can check that out if you want and that is where I'll be looking to take if it breaks out again it stays above uh, this zone 618 zone for our moving average I will be targeting 12.4 K that will be my next target level and I do lots of Fibonacci support and resistance moving average analysis to give you guys the zones I shared with you this zones uh, before a few days ago and now every week I try and uh, keep you guys give you guys a market map to use on your trading so that's my thoughts on Bitcoin that's my price prediction in a way if we stay above it I'm gonna target that level if we close below 618 and this daily moving average don't provide support and it gets back below ten and a half K that's when I'll be getting bearish uh, on Bitcoin and it and if Bitcoin consolidates guys it might be good for altcoins if Bitcoin gets back below 10k in the short term the chain link ADA which haven't broken I'll be making another video on them especially ADA's already pumped but there's other coins that I'm looking at that could potentially have another pump two coins I talked about was uh, XRP uh, L LTC yeah, 
I'll make a video on YouTube as well. Uh, I've posted about these two coins that could potentially pump. EOS I've not posted about, but it is looking good. So those are the key levels I'm looking at. This 10,400, uh, 10, 10,200, if it gets back below it, I won't be interested. And for simple traders, if it gets back below my daily moving average indicator and it doesn't pump soon, then I won't be interested. In the short term, if it keeps pumping, I'll only be trading short term now because it's so extended. If it breaks out, I'll go on the five minute time frame and look to trade so that's my update on bitcoin hopefully you guys enjoyed it and make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button uh, to stay up to date so you get notified when i'm making videos i will be making videos on ada cardano uh, link and tazos some of the other coins don't really get many views but if there's any coins that you want me to look at let me know i mean i'll make some more money on some of these smaller coins if you look at lend ontology had a big move of xlm loads of other coins but uh, the coins that you guys want me to keep you up to date i'll make it on youtube videos and the smaller coins the top five coins old key, old coin season coins i try to keep you guys up to date so check those video out, videos out so to end the video my question is what is your price predictions for bitcoin do you think bitcoin bull trend has started and is going to carry on i've shared with you my levels of what i'm looking at if it stays above you know 10 and a half k i think it carries on to 14k next and in a weekly time frame if it gets a close above uh, the 10 and 10 and a half thousand to me the bull trend has started as long as it you know stays it closes above it and stays above the daily those are the two things i'm looking at so thank you very much guys uh, comment below your thoughts on bitcoin and other altcoins do you think altcoins will work out or will it struggle comment below your thoughts on altcoin and bitcoin comment below your price prediction for bitcoin and let's have a discussion so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video go bitcoin